This is Don, my son. What are we gonna do with you? Ooh, you don't come through. What are we gonna do with you? Ooh, you don't come through. Why don't you be true? Be real for a feel. Why don't you come through? What are we gonna do with you? Ooh. A little will do. Ooh, what are we gonna do with you? What is that noise? In 1980, here in the desert, I met Don van Vliet, Captain Beefheart. I've met him quite a few times since, and basically, I really like the guy. So I made a sort of film, which is an observation of his observations. And it should give you a chance to catch a glimpse of his genius. I have an excellent memory. It's just not decorated properly. Howdy, Don. You talking to me? You talking to me, baby? Yeah, I'm talking to you, man. Maybe I'm in the zoo. How's it going, Don? The way I keep in touch with the world is very gingerly because the world touches too hard. I enjoy the environment when there are no people around. Yeah, give me lack of people. Painting is fulfilling the absence of space between the opposite meaning. Painting is so much fun. If you don't like something, you paint it out. Mondrian, I like his paintings so much that I keep my mouth tastefully shut. Pete did a thing called Broadway Boogie Woogie. My favorite painting, you could hear the horns honk. Van Gogh did paintings so good that upon walking out of the museum, I said, the sun disappoints me so. The difference between art and music, one you can physically drown in being paint, the other you can mentally drown in. I prefer swimming in paint. Art is as close as you can get to perfection without getting caught up in the wink. I hate to talk about art. What can there be when somebody says, 
I love the way you and I say I'm just combing my hair. When you sculpt little things, it makes your fingers feel delightful. Need a pen. Need a be. I felt funny without the B A N. That's Jan and me. That's Jan. That's me. The ocean is very similar to the desert. It's just that the ocean is wet and the desert is dried up ocean. A painted bird cage above a hacksaw ocean with a lovely redwood stalks with zillions of raindrops falling is like where I live now. Nice material for a sculpture. Roland Kirk was playing down in Hermosa Beach and he came up to me on the last set and said, <laughs> where can I get some ribs? And I said, the only place in Los Angeles you can get ribs this time of night, Roland, is in the Bible. Nice hairdo. Ravens I use in my paintings because they clean up the land. Buzzards are nice too. They also clean up the mistakes on the highway done by human beings. Uh, Don, I think I told you that uh, one of my favorite things you did was uh, the dust blows forward and the dust blows back. Or are you, you know, hearing any sounds at all? replica stank so bad it was just a cut off carp's head hopefully animals are smart enough to stay away from human beings because they're too nice. Humans are so mean that they uh, try to experiment to see what makes them 
tick right now the Chinese are killing tigers thinking it improves their manhood and if they don't stop it they have a pussy problem it was the only Frank Zapp I knew I met Miles Love the way he could uh, bend over and almost touch his toes and blow a horn. I won't soon forget him. Uh, Don, um, I know you're from the desert, and uh, I was wondering uh, if you could talk maybe a little bit about the sun and uh, the heat of the sun and how that, you know, affected you. I'm glad it didn't stroke me. <laughs> I like to tell you, people watching and listening, boo!